部屋に入ったばかりの時は全然自分の時間はなかったですからね。Takayasu is one of the best examples of how tough a sumo wrestler's life can be. He said it himself. まあ、自分のね、うん、家に帰れるし、そういうのをその関取目指して。The constant demands of a strict, regimented lifestyle was enough for him to run away more than a few times from his stable. These are training centers where sumo wrestlers go through hellish training every single day. His decade long career has been a mix of successes and bleak records. And his rise to the salaried ranks of sumo, these are the top two divisions of sumo, isn't as spectacular as the other young gifted wrestlers you see in the top division today. His career high was a promotion to Ozeki, sumo's second highest rank, but was not able to retain it well. You can throw your grudge towards injuries that you inevitably get when you participate in an extreme combat sport like sumo. Where huge masses collide with each other at 30 miles per hour speeds at the Tachiai. Takayasu's last tournament as a Zeki was in November 2019, his 15th tournament at Sumo's second highest rank. He withdrew due to lower back pain on day 8, which meant a second consecutive losing record will get him demoted from the rank. On this occasion, A double digit winning record as Sekiwake can secure a re promotion to Ozeki for Takayasu. But his sixth loss in the January 2020 tournament lost him his chance for re promotion. That means Takayasu, the former Ozeki, has to battle his way to earn another 33 wins to be able to regain his title. Consecutive double digit wins in the Sanyaku ranks in 2021, 10-5 as Komusubi in March, and another 10-5 as Sekiwake in May, gave him an extraordinary chance to regain his title as Azeki if he could win the championship in July 2021. But an injury he sustained during training right before the July tournament had him withdraw in the first two days of the tournament, immediately scrapping any hopes of an Azeki re promotion. Another injury in the September 2021 tournament, this time a hip injury, made everybody feel like seeing Takayasu as Ozeki is nothing more but a dream. Especially when we see the former Ozeki, a strong, powerful wrestler, rack up a mere 6 9 record in the last Basho of the year while in the mid bracket of Sumo's top division. But his performance at the March 2022 Basho has given some light at the end of the tunnel. His solid display of sumo has garnered him impressive straight wins in this tournament. It seems he has regained his old strength and stability as he defended against pusher thrusters and even technical grapplers. Granted, you can only count on one hand the number of wrestlers who have regained their Azeki title after spending more than six tournaments outside of the Sanyaku ranks, but looking at Takayasu's career, no, it had been a slow burn since the beginning. Just like his father encouraged him to go back to the stable every time he came home crying and giving up, Takayasu could well be on his way back to the rank he truly belongs.